You know, initially the Decatur City Police Department was uh, responding to that area in the 1800 block of Ferris uh, regarding a bomb threat of some type. Uh, they conducted their investigation. They found no evidence of any type of bomb or bomb threat that actually would have been carried through. Uh, later on that evening, around 8 o'clock, uh, the Sheriff's Department receives a uh, complaint of a suspicious package coming from the resident uh, in that area. It just so happens that the actual mailbox is across the street from the residence which falls into the county's jurisdiction. So since it fell in the county's jurisdiction we went ahead and evacuated the immediate area uh, and waited for of course the bomb squad to get here. The bomb squad is associated with what we call Region 7 ILEAS and it's a law enforcement alarm system type response. So mutual aid uh, this bomb uh, squad from the University of Illinois comes in and they go ahead and assist us with any type of technical services we may need. Since it was a suspicious package, uh, they were able to go ahead and obtain the suspicious package from the area, uh, render it safe for us, uh, at which time we then collected it as evidence. The investigation uh, is now involving the ATF uh, and the FBI, uh, and we are working very closely with them in reference to this case. You came home at 8.30 at 8 .30 p.m., mm -hmm. and you saw there were some sheriff's cars and some fire There was cars. a sheriff's car and a fire truck down okay. there, and they were, uh, they had, we had to get permission to come home. And we got that, and it was after 10, I think, when um, the, the bomb squad truck got here, I think, a little after 10. And they took a, they took three hours to really do the whole whole process, and the robot came down and just um, checked the mailbox out, and finally opened the door, pulled out a bag, something dropped on the ground, and you know. Anyway, they detonated that, and then they looked for something else after that, and. Um, then detonated that. So there were two detonations. The mini explosion would actually bend our bomb squad causing uh, the item to be uh, rendered safe. So it wasn't the, the actual suspicious package exploding, it was an actual uh, technique used to be able to render it safe. The first one was de detonating on the right of the mailbox and he looked and looked and looked and he looked in the trees and looked up and down the trunk and the telephone pole and and then uh, I think I went to bed and she said, oh, they just detonated another one. You know, any, anybody that can assist us in this investigation, we greatly appreciate it. Uh, it is an ongoing investigation. It is an active investigation.